I'm not always late, but I am always just on time. Just like God, He comes just in time. Just like how I'm gonna be in your life. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, baby girl. Go. What are some things that you have coming up this new year that you are looking forward to? Um, starting back in 2000, I think 18, I started doing this grand to-do list where instead of making like a new year's resolution or anything like that, I would make a list of all the things like major things and then also very minor things too that I wanted to see happen or change for me in the upcoming year and I gotta tell you it has been the smartest key for someone like me I don't know if it's for everyone but like for someone like me that needs to see a direction it is it's been amazing for me and it's been amazing to go through that book and see all the things little and big that I've been able to like get off that list um, for example I had some travel destinations on my list that I was able to check off some I will be checking off this upcoming year fingers crossed that everything goes well but that's what I mean by a grand to-do list It's just a, a big list it was I think about 16 things or so I didn't really number it I just bulleted it and things that I wanted to do professionally travel wise uh, schools, career, friendship, body, water intake. <laughs> that was on my list and I ended up getting this big old jug that I've been keeping up with and even improved my water intake. Hopefully that will later show up more in my skin. But yes, stuff, just stuff like that. Uh, to interrupt, I got a new foundation. This is the Urban Decay Stay Naked Foundation in the color 91NN. I previously did a review for, what was it, what was it, what was it, what was it? Anastasia Foundation. I love the foundation, I love the creamy texture of it, but it was making me red. I looked more red than anything else. Um, I usually just do a few pumps of this. This is a medium coverage foundation. I like to keep it medium so I did three pumps of this and go ahead and put it all over my face but this one seems to be like the perfect match I don't know how it looks in this light with this camera I absolutely love it it looks effortless and it just makes my skin look good it's very minimal um, I like the feeling of looking like I'm not really wearing makeup even though I am so just something soft gotta hit the the forehead go ahead go ahead go ahead go ahead baby girl go ahead I don't know why that song came out here how does that have to do with anything shawty get it on <laughs> I'm trying to be out of the house by five and I'm trying to be that one friend that's not always late I'm not always late but I am always just on time just like God he comes just in time. Just like how I'm going to be in your life. I always come just in time. Okay? Okay. It's 4.30. I got 30 minutes. Girl, shut up. Hurry up. Let me go ahead and fast forward through this real quick. I will be meeting up with my friends tonight. We have known each other since the freshman year of college. I graduated in 2016. We are now at the end of 2019. So we've known each other since 2011. Wow. We started this program at uh, my school at Kennesaw State. And it was called the Early Start Bridge Program, where you start early, start a month early before everyone does. And it was a few of us, like a handful of us, that started early in the summer and we've been friends ever since. There have been a few people that we're friends with that kind of just dropped off as, as we went, but we still kept in contact. Even when I was in China, I was still active or tried to be active in the group chat. And they've just been there since, 
since forever i was roommates with one i've never been roommates with the other one but we are going to do a christmas gift exchange because we didn't see each other during christmas so this is the time that we will be doing our christmas gift exchange i am putting a little bit of highlighter this is the fenty beauty is this kilowatt no this is moscow mule i don't know why i thought this was kilowatt definitely not but this is moscow mule i put a little bit under my brow i bought this new um eyeshadow palette that i don't know if today is the day that i would try it out we might as well pop it open it's called the laura geller new york the delectables is the smoky neutrals i picked this up because i need new colors but i'm also kind of scared of bright colors and i usually go for the neutral tones so this is another neutral i will one day maybe do the bright colors but i'm trying to think realistically of like where i go and what i do i literally work 40 hours a week i don't have time to like zhuzh it up with my eyeshadow color when i am off i teach online <laughs> i don't think my students would be that crazy they probably love it i don't think their parents would be that crazy over me doing that and I'm not waking up that early in the morning. I teach students in China, so I'm not waking up that early in the morning to do eyeshadow. And once in a while, when I do have like a free weekend, I meet up with my friends like today. I don't have time. Maybe one of y'all can take me out on a date or something. I just want free food, to be honest with you. But maybe then, maybe then I'll dress up and do a eyeshadow that's colored. That's another thing that needs to be a story time. My mishaps with uh, Tinder, and I've kind of given up on that, but I need to take y'all through my, oh, it comes with a little brush. I need to take y'all through my inbox on Tinder to see why, just why I stopped responding to people. 2020 is going to be a real focus on your career type thing. Focus on building this channel please subscribe share make sure you put on that bell to get notifications when i post new videos so that's honestly what my 2020 will be i'm open to making new friends and meeting new people i think that's my biggest thing it's so hard to make friends after college i need to network more i need to go to more um, events with other youtubers natural hair community people and then also like the fit fit crew of atlanta i don't know if there's an actual crew but i need to network more i need to meet more people just me trying to get my channel out there i've just it's so difficult to do because people that you normally follow they just watch your stories they watch you promote and oh please subscribe please subscribe but they only a few and i really do appreciate the ones who do subscribe but most of my supporters have come from other youtubers and i really appreciate that it's come from other youtubers and other creatives more so than just my friends on instagram and i've really had to learn not to take that personally i i feel like a wendy wendy williams right now sucking on this haul but my throat was itching One looks better than the other guys. <laughs> sisters, not twins. Sisters, not twins. Sisters, not twins. It's gonna have to do. I'm gonna be on my grown woman thing. I don't know how that's gonna work out, but I am going to just do a plain lip. This is just the Victoria's Secret Get Gloss Lip Shine. I love a good lip liner because it makes it look like you tried even if you didn't it's not much of a color it's like a, a neutral clear shimmer i think we are pretty much done i'm gonna put some shimmer 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 on my cheek and then right above my lip and we good to get dressed and we good to go
and subscribe. Let all of your friends know to come check out my videos. I have tons of videos on this channel, so please check it out. And thank you for watching. I usually post every Tuesday by 3 p.m. if life doesn't get in the way. If it does, then it's just going to be extended. But if not, I usually post on time every Tuesday. Uh, rise and shine, gotta get the day started, sun beaming in my face as the blessings keep falling.